construction on a new parking garage in Fayetteville could end up costing taxpayers a whole lot more money, but most of them won't even be able to use it. We sent Sheena Elzey to get answers about the increased price tag and how the city plans to pay for it. City leaders have been talking about whether or not to hand over more money for this multi-million dollar parking deck, but some are concerned not everyone will be able to use it. Developers are asking for more public money to finish a new parking deck that was not meant for the general public to use. Which doesn't make any sense at all. Doesn't make any sense. And downtown business owners are already frustrated. It's just the parking and make it for everyone. And I think it would draw more people down here because that's what I keep hearing. Parking, parking, parking. There's no place to park. The new deck is being built right next to the new baseball stadium downtown. Back in February, one of the partners told us. The parking garage again is not uh, being built to park for parking games. That instead, parking was meant only for people leasing the spaces in the new hotel or other Prince Charles developments. I've learned developers just asked the city for close to $2 million extra to do it. Why even put any public money in it at all if the public can't use it? Well, at the end of the day, uh, the public will be able to use it. The mayor says that's because they're in negotiations with developers about adding parking spaces in the deck for general public use. But it's unclear just how many there will be. Well, uh, there are certain spaces that are dedicated to the taxpayers. And what came up last night is that if there are even more spaces that, that are available that the taxpayers uh, could utilize as the parking demand goes up. But one business owner says she has her own solution. If it does become an issue, we'll probably end up reimbursing people for their parking. If parking becomes a bigger problem downtown. We reached out to the developers of this project and still have not heard back yet, but the mayor says the developers asked for more money because of weather delays and construction costs. The mayor says they're expected to vote in the next few weeks whether or not to give the developers that extra money. In Fayetteville, Sheena Elzey, CBS 17 News.